Hello everyone. Today I am going to teach you how we can implement Firebase Analytics into React JS application. Basically, we are going to track user activities. Okay. So, firstly, I am going to create one React JS application. So, write npx create React app and then write the application name. So, I am using as my app analytics. This is the name. And hit enter. and open chrome and write google uh, console.firebase.google.com and then you will get this type of dashboard so write, uh, click on this add project option and here you have to write your project name so i am using as rose kharido web analytics and then click on continue and then select this and click on continue and then here uh, you will have to create uh, one google analytics account so I am using as Rose Kharido Analytics and then save this and uh, just select country and then click on this and then click on create project and here you can see our project is creating into firebase as well as our react.js application is creating So our project is created into firebase and now i am going to click on this continue button so uh, after clicking on continue button we will see this type of dashboard so click on this web option which is available here okay and then here uh, you will have to mention your project name so i am using as rose kharido web analytics and then click on this register app button and here uh, you will have to uh, you will get this type of documentation so react.js application is creating and uh, here you can see our project is created successfully now so please wait it is taking time so yeah the project is created successfully now i'm going to open my project so just open a uh, react so this is my project this project and then select this folder so this is our project which i have opened and then click on the uh, just open terminal and then write npm start to check whether it is working or not so the application is running and this is the app.js file here we will add some uh, buttons and we will trigger all the events okay and uh, our project is running so now you can see uh, this is our project and uh, i'm going to remove all the codes and just write rafce and just write this okay and uh, you can see this So here I am going to uh, create three or four buttons.
so this is our first button okay which we have created and just create this function button function one okay and uh, i'm going to simply console this whether it is working or not so and just uh, open this console and uh, here uh, i am going to clear this all and then i am going to hit this so you can see uh, we are getting this hello okay similarly uh, i will create one more button button 2 and one more button uh, button 3 okay and then similarly we will create two more function for button 2 and button 3 and uh, just change the name as button 2 and button 3 but before this i am going to uh, write 1 2 3 after this hello so we will check accordingly so you can see our console is wor working and the button click is also working and now i am going to firstly i am going to install this package so just uh, stop this and then uh, paste this command and then press enter and then copy this code okay and the firebase package is installing and here i am going to paste that code which i have copied okay and uh, after this get analytics we will uh, we will pass one more uh, variable that would be log event but it is not showing because the package is uh, installing now okay so it is not showing so after installation of this package uh, we will get the option and here uh, just uh, click on continue to console and inside this analytics click on this real time uh, real time analytics okay and uh, view more in google analytics button is there uh, so you will get the real time user activity here here you can also track the user activity with more ways so click on this button to get the real activity and uh, this is the google analytics okay here you can also track the user activity like user in last 30 minute users in last okay and all the geogra geographical areas and here you can see our firebase package is installed successfully and just clear this and now i am going to start our application so just write npm start and here you will get this option log event because we have installed our dependency successfully and uh, now inside this button function i am going to use log analytics uh, sorry uh, log event and then inside this we will pass analytics and the second parameter would be the message which we are going to a uh, trigger okay event which we are going to trigger so just copy this and uh, i am going to paste inside this button 2 also and uh, change the uh, button trigger name okay here also 
so now I'm going to save this and I'm going to start our application So here you can see uh, no users now and because it takes around 30 minutes to show the user activity so just click on this uh, button so you can see uh, we have trigger one event by clicking on first button uh, similarly I am going to click on the second button to trigger next event and similarly we will trigger this third button third event and now I am going to check whether it is working or not so here uh, you can see one user is active and uh, okay so and inside this uh, uh, you will see the button one clicked okay and inside this firebase you can also see uh, the user activity and here you can see button one click button two click button three cl click because we have clicked uh, these all buttons and here you can also track all the buttons clicked okay so we have successfully integrated this into react js application